What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another episode on the channel. Today, first and foremost, I want to start off by wishing everyone a Merry Christmas. Hope everyone has a safe and blessed holiday. Um, this video is about the Foam Cannon, um, a little budget-friendly Foam Cannon that you can pick up on Amazon. I think I picked this one up for about 16 or 18 bucks. Uh, it's not the actual brand, name brand. Um, of course, the logo, I stuck that on myself. But basically, this is a really good gift i know it's kind of today is christmas but it's never too late to get something like this for one of your car enthusiast uh friends or family members or what have you um this thing right here works great you don't need much pressure to to get it to work i think you can use it with electrical uh, electric pressure washers um, of course i use it on a gas powered pressure washer and this thing works wonderful i do recommend also replacing the orifice you can get picked that up also as well you can pick it up on Amazon. I put the links for all this stuff uh, in the description box below. Basically, you can pick that orifice up. Uh, it's a modified orifice. You basically just come in here, knock this air, uh, air fitting off, you unscrew that original orifice, you put the new orifice in, and it allows you to have a lot thicker foam. Uh, you can use that foam cannon with just your regular car wash, your Meguiar's or uh, Turtle Wax car wash, whatever, and it'll work. It'll do its job, uh, but if you want to really get a better, thicker foam, you can offer something like this. You know, I actually picked up this, the Honeydew, and I also picked up the Mr. Pink, um, which is a pink uh, chemical guys uh, solution. And what that does is basically it allows you to really get some real thick suds, and it works great. It looks cool uh, when I'm washing the truck. I know the neighbors all really. Uh, enjoy watching it. They, they're kind of an awesome times because it I can really get that thing to get real thick on the truck and just let it sit and, uh, Now of course down here in South Texas, we can't really wash uh, We can't really leave the soap on, on the surface too long because it's really hot So normally once you spray it you got to be real quick about getting it washed off and that'll start drying uh, And that brings me to my next point that I know it's Christmas and yes, I was able to wash my truck two days ago because in, down here in South Texas, it's still warm, still t-shirt weather outside. Um, so you never know what the weather's gonna be like. It might be super cold tomorrow and then the next day it's gonna be warm. So I have a little video that I put together. Y'all can check that out. The whole video was shot again, like I mentioned before, the whole video was shot on the Canon uh, 200D or SL2 uh, with the 18 to 135 uh, STM kit lens. Um, I use that lens. I use the 50 millimeter 1.8 also, but you know, I'm pretty excited that I actually have the Sigma coming uh, on order now, the 18 to 35. I'm excited because that's the first actual pro level lens I'm going to get. I know it's a couple years out. I know a lot of people have already had it, used it, and reviewed it. But I, I mean, I kind of, I'm real excited about the sharpness. So I went ahead and ordered me one, and, and I got me a new one because I was looking at used, and, and I mean, people were still asking for the same amount. Uh, for it used is what I got it brand new, so it was a no-brainer for me just to get it brand new. Um, so I'm excited. You know, I ordered the calibration dock as well, so I can kind of, if I have to calibrate it or what have you, I can do that. But it looks like it's going to be a pretty good lens. I'm excited to start recording footage with it, and uh, also got a stabilizer coming because that shaky footage it's really annoying. Um, now I've, I've tried, you know, the tripod, but it's just easier to have, you know, go out there with my, you know, handheld. But, you know, that's something that hopefully when that stabilizer comes in, I can kind of correct that. Thanks for watching. Uh, thanks for tuning in to another video. Uh, I'm excited for the content that's to come. I'm excited for all the stuff that I'm going to be able to put together and work on. Uh, if you're new to the channel, again, my name is Ernest Pacheco. I'm a beginner content creator slash video maker, photographer. Or, um, but this is my channel. I hope to see you all here for future videos. Again, hit the like, hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell for notifications and tune in so I can keep giving you all some content so y'all can check out.